Oh, there's a cat that loves to squeak. And there are cats with cute little peats. And there are cats with stripes and cats with manes. So let's walk around the combo tonight. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Oh, hi. Oh, hello. Hello. Hi, babies. Hi, my little one. Oh, you guys. Oh. No, thank you. Please don't. Please don't. <laughs> what? What? What is that? Okay, that is my shorts. Those are my clothings. That is my skin. All right. Oh my gosh, look at all these bones. Look at all these bones. It's a boneyard. It's a boneyard in here. You savages. You, you savages. You monstrous brutes. Okay. I don't want to wake you guys up too much because they were actually just kind of napping a little bit. <laughs> Look at them. Sneaky babies. Hello. 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 That's a good sign. That's a good sign. No, you keep on putting your paw out. Put your paw out for me to shake it. There you go. Thank you. Pleasure to meet you. <laughs> Hi. Thanks. Thanks. Hello. Well, a little whisker tickle. You know, a little whisker tickle. Whis whis whisker whisker tickle. Say that three times fast. Whisker tickle. Whisker tickle. Whisker tickle. It's hard. It's hard. Okay, I gotta go. Z. Hi, Z. Hi, Z. Hello. Hello. Hi, baby. <laughs> Bless you. All right. Hello all you big cat lovers out there, it's me Derek again. Welcome to another super duper fantastic episode of the Walk Around the Compound webcast. Hi, hello, hello. Beautiful day that we're having out right now. Beautiful day. T-shirt and shorts weather. It's beautiful. We got some of the winter green coming through. The winter green. Sticks of gum just growing up all over the place. But that is a thing. There's winter, there's summer grasses and winter grasses here in Tejas. Arch. All right. So we were talking to the upper in the last cast. Now you gotta talk to. The low down kitties. The lower kitties. So low. Oh, there's a there's a tour going on right now. We have to avoid detection. We have to avoid detection. There's Ezra. I'm playing uh I'm playing Horizon Zero Dawn now. I know that <laughs> so many people, a lot of and a lot of the nerds are going to be just like, "Oh my gosh, 2016 cars in their video game." Why did give it? Shut up! I've told you this how many times that I only play. I like I will wait oftentimes years before I can like really understand which games are worth my time to play. So I generally go for some of the big blockbustery kind of ones. I will say that I did actually buy 
Hi. I mean, yeah, yeah. View. Ew. Oh, he's going to come over here. <laughs> yeah. You don't have pearls of wisdom, you have rocks of dum dum. That's what you give. Alright. I did, I, I got uh, the newest Modern Warfare though, like within the week that it came out. So sometimes I do get games like that are new, but that's not so much of a stretch. <laughs> I play the campaigns. Which, by the way, this campaign was, incre it was pretty incredible. One of the best um, single player first person shooter campaigns I've ever played. Not to mention some of the best, uh, you know, graphics and cutscenes and uh, what they're able to do. What they're able to do just for depth of emotion and like facial features and whatnot in certain cut, <laughs> kind of cutscene high five within video games, it's incredible. It's incredible. And uh, the lighting, the lighting in this game was the best I've ever. It, I literally, the best. I know that sounds weird to sit there and like, oh, the lighting, but it's like, seriously, the lighting. In the latest uh, Call of Duty, is the best, most natural-looking lighting that I have ever seen uh, in a video game. Just certain lighting effects, just the way that certain again, it's hard, like low light type things. It's because I've played video play, okay, you played video games for years. And video game developers over time have done a pretty good job of like capturing things and light and shadows and the way that uh, light behaves in certain situations. But whenever you're playing a video game, you can always tell it's like, oh, I'm actually in an artificially generated kind of world. And a lot of times it's like based off of like strangely enough, it's the lighting, the way that the the way that this light looks, and it's again the way that li this light looks here in the camera versus here in the eyeball way different that's why it's like so many different people whenever they i love it when they can come and tour the facility and see it uh in person because so many of you uh watch these videos and get to experience this place and experience these cats in like that that little that little box that little box of yours and it's a whole different kind of thing anyway as far as video game lighting is concerned, what I was seeing in that lace game, it was pretty incredible because it's like, whoa, it's, it was, it's, there were certain situations like, this is, it's bizarre. If you know what you're looking for, it's just, it's like, like, wow, they were, they, they did some pretty amazing technical stuff. Meaning the video game developers. Very impressive. Very impressive. Hi. Huh? Hello. Hi, Miss Dude. Hi, Miss Dude. Hmm. Kiara is. It's an old. It's an old Swahili word. Means. She who has tood. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. What? 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 Miss? Dude. Dude. Oh my gosh. I can't even raise an eyebrow around that girl. Without her just getting just barky. Barky. Hey ZZ. We meet again. We meet again. We meet again. Hi, Munch.
Hi, Mr. Munch. We're not gonna. We're not gonna have an incident with the bear again, are we? We're not gonna. We're not gonna have a repeat. Cause that was. That was slightly traumatizing. Hey, 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 whoa, no, 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 Munchie, 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 just quit it, quit it, quit it, he's still, no, no, Munchie, no, Munch, what, what, okay, here's the thing. We established on the fancy cast. We established on the fancy cast that that's okay. Because it looked a little bit like okay when we were filming the webcast. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to be as cryptic as possible because this is still a family kind of thing. We're filming the um when we were filming the regular cast. It seemed as if Munchie was engaging in behavior that would usually put him that would put a similar. <laughs> no, Munchie. That, that would land. That would land someone. Um, like. I'm <laughs> trying. It's frowned upon. That's what I should say. Frowned upon within the community. That's generally. Yeah. Hi, Munch. Hi, Munch. And then, in the fancy cast, come to find out that uh, Munchie and the Bear have actually um, discussed at, at length uh, the range of their activities, and they're very... Everyone is, everyone is signed off on what's going on so yeah not here to shame but it's not to say that that doesn't can't just take place not in such a public okay there's still look just because you like whatever you want to do as long as everyone's kind of like cool that's fine fine all right Try not to judge. So I don't have to understand it. Don't try, but I'm not gonna try to judge it. But that doesn't necessarily mean that you gotta throw it in my face much. Doesn't mean that everyone wants to see that. Alright? Just because you and the bear have agreed to a thing doesn't mean the rest of us have agreed to a thing. Alright? That's just please respect that. I know, I know. Yeah, I know. Uh, 2000, 2019. The timing was bad because, yeah, he was in the middle of a stinky face. It would have been a lot better. <laughs> Had he been looking this way when I did that initial zoom. And he looked away just right at that spot. Hi, princess. Hi, princess. Oh, oh look at her beats. Oh. <laughs> Hi, baby. Hi, super pie. Hi, fuzzy. Hi, fuzzy squishy. Hi, fuzzy squishy. Fuzzy squishy baby. Fuzzy squishy baby. <sighs> These cats. I gotta. I say. I say, I don't know why I said. I, don't, I say. I unironically said that. Oh yeah, Heidi was talking about that. Yeah. Ra's in a mood. Okay. Yep, he is. He's kind of being weird and protective, and uh, not necessarily. Well, I shouldn't even say p protective. He's being possessive of Zuby. So, 
I'm not going to try to, I, I don't want to poke that situation. So hopefully by the time I come back next week, it'll be good. Uh, anyway, thank you for watching this episode of the Walker on the Compound webcast. Hashtag Dorbus Ward in the comment section below. Like and subscribe for all your big cat goodness. And if you want to learn more about the web, the, the, if you want to learn more about the facility around me, you can always go visit the website carerescuetexas.com for more information. And I'm going to go film a fancy cast. So if you want to get more content, more webcasts, if you can't get enough casting, you can visit the Patreon. Link in the video description below. All right. I'll talk to you folks later. Bye-bye. Oh, there's a cat, cat that loves to squeak. Oh, there's a cat, 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 cat. Oh, there are cats, cats with cute little feet. Oh, there are cats, cat, cat, cat. Oh, there are cats with stripes and there are cats with manes. So let's watch as Derek walks around the compound tonight.